Hi Scorpios, it's Dream Seer 444 here to do your reading for the week. Scorpio, let's take a look and see what the energies are like around you guys. Um, what you're dealing with, how we can get some advice to help out if if need, you know. So Scorpio, let's take a look. Okay, what's that flipping out? I'm just going to reshuffle that because Six of Swords did want to come out. So maybe some of you are moving away from a situation, moving on to calmer waters, to something, you know, being led away from a, from something. But let's, let's go. What's the energy around Scorpio? And then we get the chariot. Okay. All right. So I do feel like many of you, Scorpio, are moving away Um quickly away from some type of situations that are bringing you a lot of adversity um you're moving towards emotional balance right now this could also be you thinking about traveling or looking to travel you could also be changing directions um from some type of um situation maybe you're moving on from uh, some type of job or maybe you're moving on from some type of relationship but there's definitely something that you um, could be moving away from because I did see that six of swords first okay so it could be some type of opposition that you were met with and you're making a decision to change course now you have the five of pentacles so this could be something regarding finances you may have been dealing with some type of financial hardship and now you're looking to move on to something more balanced more successful more stable for you because you're feeling that um there's better opportunities out there for you okay let's see what else is the other energy around scorpio i'll take these two some of you could be using your creative um side being more creative right about now thinking about things that are gonna um that kind of feed your passions now this could also be with the seven of cups you could have a lot of choices to make you may have a lot of options when it comes to um employment career or relationship there may be different things that are presenting itself to you so you want to be careful about the choices that you make you want to be very um careful that you you're making healthy decisions okay there could also be some type of surprises that come towards you something may come to you unexpectedly okay you have to switch the three of swords here so you could be thinking about heartbreak disappointment you could be thinking about having to separate from um, a person or a establishment or something um, knowing it's going to be painful but feeling that it's the best thing for you okay that's for some of you you have the knight of wands here so you could definitely be dealing with um, some type of travel or moving towards your goals um, you kind of could be a little bit in, could be energetic about moving forward into some type of passion like I said before with the knight of wands and even with the seven of cups I feel that some of you are are definitely um, awaken to your 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 passions things that you really want to do things that um really appeal to to you energetically let's say now this, the knight of wands could also be lust and so could be the seven of cups so you guys be careful that you're not giving in to lust and um <laughs> lust over love <laughs> you want to make sure that your your choices don't lead you into some type of five of pentacles situation okay where you're you're missing out on opportunities and stuff so you have the eight of swear also so you could be very much in your head about something you could be isolating yourself right now because there's a lot on your mind you could be focused on um bringing yourself to the truth about situations that you did not really um see clearly before those things could be coming to you now okay also scorpio let's see what else you have you have the page of pentacles so there could be some good news or some message about money that comes in and i know this is gonna make you very happy because it looks like you guys were already looking at moving away for some of you moving away from a situation that um to something more stable financially so there you could be manifesting a new opportunity a new job a new business something along that line for some of you you could be thinking um 
about making an offer of some sort to someone or something. Okay. Could be a child involved. You have the full card. So this is definitely some type of new beginning. You could be more spontaneous right about now, Scorpio. Really taking um, taking risks and going out there and trying something new. This could be you going into some type of field that you, you're not too familiar with, but wanting to give it a chance. You could be taking the limits off of your life and just deciding to live free and, you know, and not worry about tomorrow. This could just be you um, taking on this new mindset of I'm going to go out there and I'm going to make, you know, make the best out of, of a situation. I'm not going to, I'm not going to worry anymore about, about it. I'm just going to go out here and do it. You know, you have the three of cups also. You could be celebrating with friends around this time, especially this is being New Year's. You could be celebrating some type of victory, something that you, um, definitely heal from okay this could be you establishing friendships you know getting out and doing more you know with the full card i could see some of you just making a decision to um to go out there and try something new give me one moment scorpio okay scorpio so i'm back i do apologize for that so we're here at the three of cups so i feel like this is you Celebrating some type of victory after um, going through something, something that you may have healed from, and now you are, um, you're now celebrating. What else do we have? You have the lovers. Okay. All right. So with the lovers and the three of cups, I do feel that some of you are celebrating um, some type of maybe a new type of uh, relationship. Or this is you having to make some type of choice between two. That's with the three of cups and the lovers. All right, Scorpio. So for some of you, you could have some type of relationship um, situations going on where you're needing to make a decision. Okay. And then you have the death card. Yeah, you need to make a decision about putting an end to some type of connection. This could be past energy, but you know, I'm just going with what I'm reading here. Now, others of you... Maybe um, making a decision as to whether you want to transform a relationship, take it to the next level, possibly. OK, you may be going through some type of transformation, maybe some type of spiritual transformation, um, some type of rebirth. OK, that's for Scorpio, the five of sword. There's could have been some type of um, strife, some type of confusion that you maybe may have been dealing with or something that you're currently dealing with. So there may be some ten tension somewhere. Scorpio, this could be you also feeling wild. And then you have the Ten of Swords. This could be you feeling that um, feeling that you're you're in some type of competition or someone has put you in a competition. So you may be feeling that um, you're having to compete for someone's time, for someone's energy or something. And but with the Five of Swords and the Ten of Swords, I feel that you may be very much in your head about some, some type of betrayal or some type of loss, okay? You may feel defeated in some area when it comes to something. But this could also be you coming to the end with the Ten of Swords. This could be the end of some type of, of pain and heartbreak. There's no, you know, you've already reached the farthest it's going to go, okay? And you have the Five of Wands. There was definitely some type of conflict and confusion possibly some competition or you may have felt some type of competition between um you and someone else i feel that that is has, is coming to an end yeah this is like some type of what else for scorpio four of cups this may have left you feeling you know left out you know, Scorpio, let me just say this. I <laughs> I kind of feel like for some of you, you may have been dealing with someone and you felt that you were in competition with other people for this person. You're looking to put it, you may have put an end to the situation, but it has left you feeling, um, feeling hurt, feeling left out. Okay, or this could be the other way around. This, what else for Scorpio? What else for Scorpio? six of pentacles so you may be looking 
to um, to balance out a situation or someone may be wanting to balance out something with you giving with equal give and take. Okay, someone may be wanting to share with you now, give to you. This could have been someone who was not giving before. They are looking to give to you now. You also have the Eight of Pentacles. So someone wants to, this could be you because we're talking about your energy. So maybe wanting to give to a situation that they were not giving into before. Okay, so this could be you now focused on um, giving into a situation you may not have been putting a lot of effort in before, but now you're moving towards it. Now, for some of you, this could be dealing with relationship. Others of you, this could be work. You could be, you could have slacked off at work and maybe felt that there were some other people coming in competing for your position. So now you're, you're tightening it up, deciding to give more to your work, um, getting back on track with that. Others of you, this is a relationship situation um, for those of you who this does apply to. And then you have the King of Swords here. Okay, so this could be you coming in um, possibly to, to cut out some type of um, cut out a situation. This could be you um, coming in to speak truth or someone coming to speak truth to you. The Hangman card did come out moment so let me see what the king of swords is doing here why is the king of swords here why is the king of swords here it's the king of swords with the page of wands okay so with the king of swords I feel that um, someone may be wanting to come to towards you wanting to take a chance with you um, they want to come and speak the truth about something and and possibly um, looking to establish some type of balance with you and heal a situation you have the star card here so someone could be wanting to heal a situation with you or this could be you thinking about healing a situation with someone who you did not put a lot into at first now you're looking to um, to make some positive changes in your life and deal with um, something that you may have been avoiding before. Okay, remember the roles can re be reversed in this situation. So Scorpio, let's get some advice for you. Okay, Scorpio, put those two back. This is the one that flipped over. In the end, you tried and you cared and sometimes that is enough. So Scorpio, I'll read that again. In the end, you tried and you cared and sometimes that is enough. So if this were you who felt that you were being um, placed in some type of competition with other people and you knew that you gave everything that you could to the situation, um, just know that you've given as much as you can give to it. So some of you may decide to walk away um, knowing this, okay? But um, there is definitely something uh, where someone wants to come and speak a word of truth this could be you or someone else and try to heal some type of connection after there may have been some type of deceit or betrayal so Scorpio you guys take the message you know as it applies to you guys um, I will look forward to seeing you guys on the next video please like share comment I would love to hear your um, comments regarding what's going on here and I'll see you guys on the next reading